All right. Hey, everybody, this is Alan Taylor, and I am excited to be showing you 13107 Hesby Street, located in the Hidden Woods area of Sherman Oaks, between Fulton and Coldwater Canyon, just north of Riverside. Hidden Woods is a very popular neighborhood with only a couple entrances in. Um, they do block parties, 4th of July parade, trick-or-treating, just a wonderful neighborhood with lots of sidewalks. Uh, also, there are a lot of homes in the area built by William Mellentine, uh, who was a, one of the more, more popular builders uh, in the 50s. This home is a Melantine built house. As you can see, it was added onto by a prior owner. Beautifully done. We've got wonderful mature landscaping with rose bushes. I'm gonna show you this house uh, here shortly. Hedged in private. And we've got a beautiful water fountain here and mature hedged landscaping and these beautiful porches just the detail and the architecture with these beams of course you can sit down here uh, relax you know and just kind of see what's going on with the neighbors as they go by just beautiful architecture here all right so let's go inside the house we've got a nice little formal entry with slate floors and beautiful chandelier all right so the first room that you see inside the house is this beautiful formal living room with exposed beams gorgeous hardwood floors and then off in the distance over there you see the dining room i'm going to show you a reverse angle of this room now so you can see And you've got this beautiful floor to ceiling windows with plantation shutters. You can see the diamond panes as a signature Melantine architectural feature. Just a gorgeous room. And then adjacent to this room, you can see the formal dining room here. So very spacious. You can seat, you know, 10 for large gatherings. You can bump the table out if you need to. So adjacent to the formal dining room, we've got the kitchen here, which is super light and bright and cheery with plenty of counter space. Over here, we've got a double oven to our left. We've got this custom hood there over the stove, which is beautiful. Again, plantation shutters. These cabinets are in beautiful condition as well. We've got a little eat-in area here which is very sweet, a great place to hang and have breakfast and read the paper. And then over here, we've got a Sub-Zero refrigerator that's built in. And behind the door here is a half bath. And I will show you the, it's got a nice little vanity there and toilet, so nice room there. And then this built-in cabinet here is you know, this space is, is a space where you could do uh, a stackable or uh, laundry if you wanted to. The laundry's in the garage, um, but that's where you could do that. Uh, doorway to the outside there. We'll go outside later. One of my favorite rooms in the house is this den that we're walking into right here. You got the beautiful wood paneling and these floor to ceiling windows that capture the grounds on the outside. I'm gonna show you, oh, it's got the fireplace. Well, might as well show you that. Just beautiful, just beautiful architecture with the used brick fireplace and the paneling and the beams. There is a closet here. This could be also used as a guest room if you wanted to. And here's a reverse angle of the same room. As you can see, it's in full view of the yard. You can see the private hedge in the back, rose bushes and the pool. Beautiful built-ins over there. And I'm gonna show you a very unique and very cool feature in this house, which is this fabulous custom bar. And I've sold a lot of Melantines and I have not seen a bar like this in the den. Love it. So you've got your little Dutch door there, shelves, or excuse me, uh, 
cabinetry and shelving. So a place to hold your wine and spirits. Great for entertaining guests and family. And you can, again, be in full view of the den. All right, so let's go down the hall here and we're gonna check out the bedrooms. So down, there's a downstairs master and there's an upstairs master in this house via the addition, which I'll show you. But the downstairs master here has beautiful French doors to the outside. I'll show you reverse angle of this room. And you can see a nice closet over there, windows to the outside. And that closet kind of hangs around the corner once you open there, so the closet's actually good size. And then when you wake up in the morning, you know, this is your view out to the outside in the pool. Okay, so we're going down the hall and the two the two bedrooms downstairs are serviced by this hall bath forgive the noise but we've got a little makeup vanity there and a sink we've got a soaking tub as well as a standing shower an incredibly well cared for condition okay and then downstairs here is our second bedroom which is set up as a guest bedroom also with plantation shutters just take a look at those floors. Just in beautiful, beautiful condition. The whole house has been meticulously maintained. And then the reverse angle of that bedroom with the closet and the shutters. All right, so let's go upstairs. So very thoughtfully, very beautifully done. We've got this beautiful staircase with chandelier up to the third bedroom in the house, which I'll show you. All right, so currently set up, at, you know, this TV room, a, a separate den, just a great place to kind of get away and hang out. We've got our large screen TV, this beautiful wraparound couch, also with plantation shutters. Over there, you've got a separate office, but this is intended actually as to be a master bedroom. And the reason for that is you've got this fantastic walk-in closet through here. Just a, a very, very spacious walk-in closet. I pulled some stuff away to show you additional storage space down there, but you've got this whole entire hanging here uppers and lowers there storage above shoes more built-ins more storage and more storage so just a fabulous space there and then over here we've got a three-quarter bath and just beautifully cared for and then over here there is a standing shower so this is a three-quarter bath again in beautiful condition okay so that completes the house and i cannot wait to show you the backyard all right so we're gonna go back downstairs multiple ways to get to the backyard uh, you can go through the master bedroom downstairs through those french doors there is a door there from the den and then there's also a passageway through the kitchen so the first thing i'm going to show you is this fantastic built-in barbecue center beautiful barbecue with a fridge seating for six you could probably seat eight if you want all in full view of this fabulous backyard plenty of seats for lounging notice the hedges notice the greenery the landscaping this is absolutely a hotel like lush lushly landscaped backyard i'll show you a reverse angle of it as well more lounging areas over here Just beautiful landscaping everywhere. Got our speaker there so we could play music. 
and you can see the back of the house over there. There's a covered outdoor entertaining space, which I can't wait to show you. Look at the mature landscaping. Just super private and hedged over here as well. Okay, and then you've got this beautiful outdoor entertaining space, which is just an awesome place to hang out. One of the great things about the San Fernando Valley is these warm summer nights. You can go from the barbecue to the pool and sit down here and relax. Just, just fantastic. Show you reverse angle one more time. More loungers over here. More beautiful rose bushes. Just beautifully landscaped. And that is 13107 Hesby. Just a beautifully, beautifully manicured and maintained and lovely home located in the Hidden Woods section of Sherman Oaks. If you have further questions, please give me a call at 818-324-9329. You can direct message me on Instagram, Alan Taylor Real Estate. Thanks so much. Talk to you soon.